look where we're at on our fun day Sunday adventures. Literally, this is my, I don't know where you can see me at. <laughs> I don't really even care. Look where we're at. Okay, so what I'm gonna talk about now is I'm doing a grape and lemon detox. And I'm doing it for the new moon. So how this is gonna work is where the new moon is 26 degrees in Sagittarius. And it's coming in December 18th. So how the, the um, okay let me just tell you I you know me always have to tell a story okay so what's going on here is I'm on this website or this app right and I have people that are like finally like hearing and following me and understanding things and so of course I get banned off this app I got suspended and I don't even know how but I got suspended off of a bathing suit picture that has been up for like two years so which is didn't have anything to do with that it just had to get me off that app to get me back to where I need to be which is right here right now and since I've been off the app I have read two books I wrote three PDFs to do this whole detox we're all going to do together uh, how to do it step by step what I'm doing just all kinds of stuff I've been doing all kinds of stuff right so I got there which led me to quiet my mind and get back into myself so once I got back into myself and I everything started to open it up first I clicked on a YouTube video right to catch up on everybody that I'm following on YouTube well when I did that I there was some random lady on there that posted a video like four years ago talking about her awakening and the book she was talking about I don't know what I look like the book she was talking about was a book I had that I bought for my daughter uh, maybe two years ago and I was like I had that book so I went and picked it up and started reading it because what I was banned anyway I had nothing else to do it was cold outside it got cold in Florida yesterday so I was like well I'll just read so I started reading the book and the man start uh, in the preface he starts talking about um, a book by Napoleon Hill and I always hear about Napoleon Hill but I don't know who Napoleon Hill is okay people are walking by I look creepy talking to y'all so um, Napoleon Hill they're talking about Napoleon Hill so it makes me go research who Napoleon Hill is I ended up finding one of his books think and you're rich or something like that and then I was like what is this so I started reading some of that online and then that just led me to so many different things then I started researching the new moons and the Sagittarius and what that means and I looked where the planets were and this is what I'm doing my new year I feel does not start on January 1st but on this Gargarian calendar I'm just going to use that energy for my good okay so I said I'm already been vegan and I'm already doing all these things and when I say vegan I make my own toothpaste I make my own laundry detergent now I make my own cleaning supplies not make my own but you know use castor oil soap and use different things and make things I have a website up and I'm uploading so much stuff I make my own magnesium spray now for when you get out the shower all kinds of stuff right so I've been organizing all my stuff because that's a whole process in itself so these are just the chain of effects since I got banned off this app or suspended, suspended for a while. Is this too much, Bobs? <laughs> so anyway, I came across this lady who led me to this book that I already had that had me reading about Napoleon Hill because I hear Napoleon Hill all the time and I've never read it. And then led me to write three different things. I made three different PDFs and we'll go over that later. I wrote out the whole grape and lemon detox. Why would we even do that? And because I have people that are going to do it with me. So let me just stick to that. Let me stay on topic because I really only have two hours out here. Okay, so on this detox, I'm starting December 18th. But we're really starting two days before the new moon because as you know, parasites lay eggs on the new moon and they harvest on the full moon. So we're really starting two days before, okay? Well, I am starting on the 13th. I am going to go ahead and water fast and use warm water enemas to remove crap out of my system because where I'm at with fasting and stuff and detoxing, I have healing crisis. And when you have healing crisis, that just means it's working, okay? So I am gonna start on the 13th and I'm doing water fasting and enemas for the, the 14th and 15th because I'm starting sundown on the 13th. And then on the 16th, I'm gonna pick up with whoever's doing the fast with me, the grape and lemons. And then I'm gonna show you on day seven like how to wean back off Whoever makes it with me and does this, but I feel a lot of people are, and especially since this full new moon is in um, Sagittarius. Anyway, I just know that this is a good time for what I'm doing. 
So, and the reason I feel it's so important right now is because I'm like the tower card in the tarot. Now, the tower card where I'm at, everything's already burnt down. The coals and the wood is already cooled off. So where I'm at right now is I'm on a lot of rubble. So I wanna build my own new house, my dream house on my lot that I own. So I'm going, or I'm leasing in this incarnation. So I'm going to move out all the rubble, but I don't wanna do it stone by stone. I wanna do it by bulldozer. So that's, I'm, that's what this grape and lemon detox is. Now you guys can still email me. I'll put my website on here. I have jet, I have so many elixirs. I have flower scenes that have been sitting for so, I have so much stuff that I cannot wait to share on my website. But it's all gonna happen in due time. So that's really what we're doing right now. We're doing the detox, the grape and lemon detox, starting on the new moon. But I will make videos all through that consistently, as long as I can, because I have my own healing crisis, seriously. So look where I'm at. Do you see this? This is a spring. This is one of the springs in Florida. This is, I think, what's the name of this one? Green Spring. So this is where I'm at. And this is my church. This is my church. And like I was talking to my daughter today, we have to remember anything that happens in our life. Here, I'll just read it to you. I got my book right here. I'm gonna literally like sit out here for two hours and read. <laughs> so let me just read this one part, okay? You have to understand, knowledge is power and applied knowledge is wisdom. Do you understand that? Knowledge is power, but applied, actually applying the knowledge is wisdom. And we forget that, I know I do. So it says, each and every component that makes up your life experience is drawn to you. Did you hear me? Each and every component that makes up your life experience is drawn to you by the powerful law of attraction's response to the thoughts you think and the story you tell about your life. So each and every component that makes up your life experience is drawn to you by the powerful laws of attraction's response to the thoughts you think and the story you tell about your life. I just have to listen around because there is gators. <laughs> All right, I'm gone for now, not forever. I'll show you guys more later, we'll chat. Love you, ciao, look. Look at this. Remember, we can make heaven on earth or hell on earth. I choose heaven. And I choose you, love bugs. Okay, let's see where we're at now. So I'm going straight across here. This is where I always come and see the sunset. Look at this place. Do you see this? So you can just go straight over here. Oh, I don't want to hit the car. <laughs> and then I go straight right here. And we go into this little teeny parking space. Look at the sky. Okay, let's go see. I'll show you. I really hope that you guys really just do this detox with me. Even though I can do it by myself because I'm a big girl. But I would just love it if I had people to go with me. Look at this. All right. Oh God, I act like I don't know English. And then he talks to me in Spanish. I just cannot deal. So then you can come right here and sit. I don't come here, I go all the way out there. Look at this. Oh, what the hell, I'll just show you where I go. Look at this. So we caught, and my favorite tree that I'm working with is down there, but I don't have time to show you. Cause I have a meeting at four o'clock on Skype. Ouch. So let's look at this. Now my insides are gonna reflect my outsides completely here. Hmm. Come down here and see what you can find. Walking down the boardwalk. I can just sit here and watch this ripple. Look at that.
I go all the way to the end of the dock. But there's people bringing in their boats, so we won't do that today. We can just sit here on this bench. Yes. I love you. If nobody told you that, I swear to God, I love everyone that views me, that talks to me. Everybody is a lesson or a blessing. I learn from everyone and follow no one. Look at this. All right, I really have to go. I almost just flashed everybody. Oh, life is limitless. Gone for now, not forever.